How can our upbringing and perception of money generally impact our real estate career, home, or your friendly surroundings? I do feel that you'll be able to have a more empathetic approach to every transaction when it comes to buying and selling. So I don't think that anyone who labels clients walking through an open house based on what they're wearing or what they're driving is a great strategy. I do feel that you have to adopt what I call an indiscriminate approach to everyone you're dealing with. So whether it's a tenant leasing a studio for $200 a week or whether it's a seller who owns a $20 million property, your process, your personality should not deviate. You you need to have a high degree of authenticity. You need to treat people with respect. And also you need to have an appreciation for the hard work that's gone into every client situation, whether they're struggling to put a deposit or bond down for a small property, or they're in a situation where they are cash poor, but asset rich and need to downsize. That empathy, that understanding, that approach, and that respect will certainly go a long way to ensure that you are the appropriate real estate professional to assist them in their needs and also create a long-term relationship with all of these clients and advocates that you're connecting with.